everyone, it's Ruby here and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Now in today's video, I wanted to share with you my favorite holy grail setting powders that work for all skin types. I'm talking oily skin, dry skin, combination skin, normal skin, all skin types. And it doesn't matter what skin condition you have, I find that these powders work for a lot of people. They're just amazing powders to have in your kit if you are a makeup artist or in your personal collection if you are a makeup lover. So these, like I said, work for all skin types and all skin conditions. And my favorite thing about them is not only do they lock your makeup in place, they're very smoothing and very forgiving on textured skin. They just smooth out the skin, they blur the skin, they make everything look so fine, girl. And I just wanted to share my love of these powders with you guys. I've also included some affordable powders in there as well that you can get from the drugstore that work wonders. So I just wanted to make sure I included everyone's budget. We shall get started with the video. The first powder in this lineup is the Chanel Powder Universal Libre in the shade number three. You have seen this countless times on my channel because this is a powder that I seriously swear by. It is definitely a holy grail powder of mine. This powder has a sifter jar packaging. It contains 30 grams of product and there's also five shades available. I do believe with the amount of product that you get, it is good value for money. I've had this for the longest time and I'm not even halfway yet. I have to say that this powder is the best pore minimizing, skin blurring powder that I have in my entire collection. Moving on to my most recent makeup purchase, this is the Natasha Denona Invisible HD Face Powder. It contains 15 grams of product, it comes in two shades, and it's valued at 32 US dollars. I have to say, I really like the packaging on this powder. Yes, it does come in that typical sifter jar packaging, but this one you can close, making it ideal for travel, so it's a much cleaner to work with. You don't have to worry about your powder exploding everywhere on you, which has happened countless times in my makeup bag when I'm traveling. If you're somebody who doesn't like the look and feel of too much makeup, especially powder makeup, you're going to love this powder. It's super mattifying, it's very lightweight on the skin, and it's great if you're working in front of a HD camera. Like it just makes the skin look like your skin, but better. It's amazing, very natural looking product that I highly recommend. Now, if you've been watching me for a really, really long time, you would know just how much I adore Bobbi Brown skin products. This is the Bobbi Brown Sheer Finish Loose Powder. This is in the number one pale yellow shade. It comes with six grams of product. It's valued at 64 Australian and there's 10 shades available. I only like to use this powder underneath my eyes because the yellow is super brightening. As you can see, just applying a little bit more product right to the inner corner of my eye has really brightened and lifted the under eye area. You can, however, use this all over the face. It does an amazing job at setting both foundations and concealers. It is also super lightweight and very finely milled, and it doesn't feel like you've got makeup on your skin. It's another one of those skin blurring powders that you need in your collection. Moving on to some more affordable options. This is the Master Fix Setting and Perfecting Powder by Maybelline. This is a super micro fine powder that sets, mattifies, blurs, and smooths the skin with a really lightweight finish. This of course sets concealers and foundations really well and it locks it into place. But most importantly, you can use this powder on bare skin to help perfect your skin and make it look like your pores are smaller, your lines are smoother. It's just one of those perfecting, versatile, super affordable powders that anyone can have and you need in your collection as well. Just have a look at how this powder has blurred out the open pores and texture on my cheek area. There is absolutely no color to this powder, but Make sure you dust off any excess because it may leave a little bit of a white cast. Next in the lineup is the Urban Decay The Velvetizer Powder. This has to be one of the most unique powders that I have in my entire collection. This powder is valued at $55. You get eight grams of product and there's only one shade available, which is transparent. And the reason for this is because this powder is actually a powder which you can mix in with your foundation. Formula-wise, this powder is so fine and so soft. It is definitely one of the finest powders in my entire collection. This literally smooths out the skin. I cannot tell you how soft this powder makes your skin feel. This is a super multi-purpose product that you can use with your foundation by mixing it in or over top to set your makeup. It wears super well on oily skin, dry skin, combination skin, normal skin, and it's so forgiving on textured skin. Just look at how amazing and blurred out my skin looks. Highly recommend this one as well. For those of you who are wondering what I set my blemishes and boo-boos with, this is it. 
This is the Rimmel Clear Complexion Powder. I am absolutely obsessed with this. It is so affordable and it's been formulated to help clarify the skin. It is so effective at controlling shine and mattifying the skin without leaving drier skin types feeling like they're wearing a mask. I usually like to apply this powder with an eyeshadow brush to spot set my blemishes. Even as ridiculous as that sounds, it really, really does work. That's it guys, thank you so much for watching. Please let me know in the comment section down below what your favorite setting powders are, especially if they weren't listed in today's video. I would love to hear from you because I'm all about trying new products and I'm sure everybody else who is watching this video will appreciate your input. Thank you so much for watching my loves and I look forward to seeing you in a brand new video later on this week. I love you, bye.